Hi. Are you a wicket? Are you a wicket puppy? Yes, you are. It's your puppies. <gasps> are you a chop? Are you a chop chop puppies? Yes, you are. Alright. Good boys. Yeah. Good boys. Yes, yeah, the puppies. Those are your puppy puppies. <laughs> <laughs> hey everybody, J-Rad here. It's a new floor. Oh, yay! Anyway, so I decided to put a new tarp down for my floor under my tent area. And while we were at it, I also decided to move it away from the steps, which is great. Works out pretty good with my dogs. And also decided to put up new sides with some nice tarps. Got a new back wall, got a little exhaust fan at the top. Pretty nice, right? Also decided to make my bench area towards the back. Gives me a lot more room to work on stuff over here. Can actually probably fit a quad next to the motorcycle. It's pretty good. I like that. Um, so yeah, the only disadvantage I had about using tarps for the sides is they don't breathe as well as the uh, sombrella material that I got out there. And so it gets pretty hot in here. We had an 80 degree day today and it got to 100 degrees in here. It was ridiculous. So that's why I decided to put the exhaust fan in. It helped a little bit, but it's still pretty hot in here. So I'm kind of thinking about, instead of using zip ties on the tops, that I'll probably use some kind of rope or something, and then I'll be able to untie them, let them flop down, kind of be like, give it some open air, get some breeze blowing through. And uh, yeah, that, that'll be pretty good. These are my uh, new, my new back door. Uh, it's basically two 6x12 tarps and they're matched together so when you undo that little rope on the side that's holding them up they basically fall together and all the grommets line up and you just tie them together. It's a little makeshift door, it works. Keeps most of the rain coming out if it's coming down sideways, you know. My puppies like to play. Hey Wicket! He's a good boy. Hey Chubby! So this is one of my little projects I'm working on. As the dogs go around. So this is one of my projects I'm working on. This is actually going to be a trailer for my ATV. I'm actually making it out of a swing arm and axle from an old Yamaha Blaster. Uh, it's coming out pretty good. I still got some time left on it. Got to get a get a tongue made so I get to a hitch and all that fun stuff. Probably be able to get to that next week. It'll be nice, but. Let me go show you uh, what this looks like from the outside now. So about $100 worth of tarps and materials. I had to buy a bunch of zip ties, uh, some grommet setting tools and grommets. Learned how to do that at my last job. As you can see, I got these brass grommets. It's kind of how I did the angles and everything. You know, you just put new grommets in. Worked out pretty nice. Um, Added a post on the side here so the outside tarp can wrap around the actual inside tarp so I don't get any leakage in the corner, which is great because the last setup I had, I had mad leakage in the corners. Um, this thing's not going to be 100% waterproof, but it'll do the job. I'll definitely not be worried about things getting soaking wet and, you know, the floor might still get a little wet, but yeah. It doesn't look like a circus tent anymore. Uh, unfortunately, the umbrella material, which is awning material, you know, it has the stripes and everything. And yeah, it basically made this look like some kind of weird circus tent and freak show. So it's not quite as much of an eyesore as it was before, which is great. <clears throat> What's up, puppies? So that's what I've been up to. Um, yeah. Very happy about this. Definitely a nice place to work. A lot cheaper than building a garage.
I don't have to, it doesn't require a permit either. It's great. So, all right, everybody. Till next time. J-Rad out. Mm -hmm.